Welcome to Glamour TV. We're at Nobu for a star-studded lunch to launch Noelle Reno's new amazing fashion line called Degrees of Freedom. Hi, Noelle. Hello, Louise. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Because it's kind of sportswear, but very trendy, chic sportswear. What I, it's a blend between chic casual wear and sportswear. It's basically for the woman who would never wear a velour tracksuit who wants to look chic but has a lot of different roles in their life. I think that a lot of women, the women that I know and a lot of women out there play a lot of different roles. You know, they're career woman, they're family woman, they're managing the household. What I wanted to create was an outfit that just simplified getting dressed for them. And you can be comfortable, you can throw it on in five minutes, you know you look good and you can go and do all the things you have to do. Meredith, you're looking gorgeous. Thank you, Louise. Is it Armani? <laughs> yes, it is. Definitely one of your favorite labels, isn't it? Yeah, I can't help myself. I, I, I keep winding up wearing the clothes. I, I love them. Pussy Glamour is your amazing underwear company. What's going on with that at the moment? Um, it's really exciting. I just shot my new campaign yesterday with Brian Adams and Alice DeLau and some really cool people. So I'm really excited. The Brian was taking great. photos. Yeah, he's my official photographer. So it was really fun. The pictures oh, look amazing. Roll. I've got a new collection called Drawn to Her, which um, has a print designed by Rose Blake, who's Peter Blake's daughter. And it's got all little things for Siegler more beautiful hand drawn cupcakes and champagne bottles and beautiful hand drawn sort of lace interpretations. Really pretty. And talk me through your outfit today. Who are you wearing? Um, I'm wearing Chloe, Vintage Etro, Gap, my favourite, £2.99. Jet jeans from Fred Seagulls, Mew Mew, and Anya Highmark. My own um, tips for myself and for my wardrobe is if I wear something especially trend driven like it's very much this season I tend to kind of cheat with high street because I know it'll come and go quite quickly and and then I, I tend to invest in more classic pieces that will kind of run through season to season so I'd, I'd spend more on a beautiful suit or a lovely cashmere cardigan or something like that tell me about your new book New book's called The Single Girl's Guide at Norgo Bookshops now. Um, and actually, I spent six chapters not mentioning boys at all. It's about celebrating being single and just loving life. And you know, you get to come to things like this without boys getting jealous or saying, no, you can't possibly go and play with all your girlfriends. is everywhere at the moment. We had Serpentine last night, Fashion Rocks coming up, you're sponsoring a breast cancer care catwalk show and... The London Design Festival. Everywhere. So... How are you keeping up with it all? Well, you know, um, we really see our role as kind of a neutral force in the industry. We're not a fashion brand, but we are a supplier to the industry, be it the fashion industry, textile industry, jewelry or architecture and design. And, you know, to celebrate or, or any given opportunity where we can celebrate the talent in these industries is really important to us. Talk me through this piece here because it's amazing. Oh, this is Stephen Webster, which was created for Swarovski Fashion Rocks two years ago. And it's actually a Swarovski chandelier component with um, Swarovski cubic sagone inlaid in silver. And Stephen Webster now sells this piece at Neiman Marcus and various other retailers. I think it's one of his best sellers. Well, good luck with everything. Thank you. Let you enjoy some lunch. Thanks. Thank you.